Hello, welcome to Intro to Simplero course. This is Liz here, and I'm going to show you how the Simplero dashboard works and what we're going to be covering on the next models of this course. So when you get into your Simplero dashboard, the first you see is your homepage, where you have some graphics of what's been going on in your business. So you have your revenue graph, you have your the contacts that have been added in the past um, month to your account. You can also get um, customized help. If you click on learn more or book a discovery call, you will reach out to our concierge team. And right at the bottom, you can sign up for free and live Q&A calls um, to our training workshops programs. So um, if we start on the right top, uh, we find contacts first. And if you open that drop down, you'll find how to get to the contacts overview here. So that's everyone that has been added to your Simpler account, either through a list or through a purchase of a product. Um, they will all show up here. You can also access here your list. So we will show you how to create a new list, how to manage it, uh, how to add subscribers to it, to create opt-in forms. That's all happening here. Uh, you can also create contact segments in a bit more of an advanced feature. Um, you can see tags and you can also use support tickets through Simplero. On the marketing tab, uh, we will go through the process of creating a website, um, how to create it page by page and how to create a blog um, and configure access to, to your main website and your membership sites. We'll also show you how to create email broadcast and how to set up automatic reminders to uh, send out newsletters to your contact. We'll also show you how to set up a product and uh, how to manage purchases that happen through those products that you have for sale, how the catalog looks like. Um, so in here, you can just create any product, um, list them and so on. Uh, eventually, we'll show you as well how to create a course and how to link it to a membership site. So uh, you can also set up how to give access to the course, whether it's public to everyone or if you want to drip it over time. Um, eventually, we'll also show you how to change your URL so that you can set up your own custom domain and um, show you how to manage your, your branding, email designs, and your opt-in forms and themes. So this is a quick overview of how the Simplero dashboard looks like. Um, I'm sure that you've noticed that there are many functionalities that we might not be covering on this course, which are pretty advanced, but you will find all the information on the help guides. Something to note is that our engineering and product team works uh, deploy new features every day. So these videos might get updated at some point, but the features that we'll cover on on these lessons um, will remain mostly the same. If you have any questions or you cannot find some of the functionalities described here, just uh, reach out to our support team to help you out with that. So with this, uh, we hope that you enjoy the course and I'll see you in the next model.